Yo, what is going on, boys and girls? Welcome back to another video. Excuse me, we're trying to film a video, yeah? This is going to get very, very exciting because this is the start of the American series. Now, don't worry. If you watch the channel for the toy stuff, for the abandoned buildings, all that is still going to be happening. It's not just going to be American content. We're going to slip it in between. But it is currently 10 to 6 in the morning. Megs, what are we doing? Where are we going? And where are we? <laughs> we are at London Heathrow. We're at Heathrow Airport. Yeah, Terminal 3. And going where are we going? Illinois. Well, Chicago. We're going Illinois, which I'm getting very excited over. So excited. I can't tell you much of the plans <laughs> at the minute because Max and Sarah, who we're going to spend the week with, are literally planning everything. So we don't know what we're doing apart from we're going to see Lake Michigan <laughs> and we're going to Chicago. That's the Amazing. only things that I know. So we're excited over that. Um, yeah, so this video is going to be a bit of the airport, bit of the plane, bit of the other side traveling to our destination because we've got an awesome Airbnb right in Kankakee Town itself. So I'll show you that. And then all the American content is going to follow from year on out. But yeah, Felicia is here. Hopefully it's still going to be here when we get back. And uh, yeah, stick around for this, boys and girls. There's a lot of people tooting on here today. You can tell when the coast of London, everyone is rude. But yeah. So there we go. Bags are dropped in. I tell you what, these sorts of airports, man, there's no messing about compared to what it is in a smaller one like Bristol, for example. Big international stuff. It's a different ball game, so we've got to get through security. Obviously, I can't film that. And then we're going to be heading for the lounge. You've always got to book the lounge when you come on one of these flights. Well, on any flight, to be honest with you, we're just saving money as you go. So there we go, through security, no problems. As it should be, anyway. Megs is doing what she always does best doing the perfumes got to be done as you walk through so we're gonna head to the lounge i'm getting excited about it i haven't eaten since yesterday so food or beers first i don't know we'll see how we get on either way i'm gonna keep updating you throughout the journey but yeah check out my new kicks fresh out of the box for this trip i'm excited so you join me from the club house by a lounge here at Heathrow. I never, like I'll say this, I never understand why people don't do the lounges more often. It's always between 30 and 40 pounds per person. Unlimited drinks, unlimited food, and just chill out in nice quiet seats. You know, it's not busy, it's just relaxing before you fly. So this is my 7 a.m. currently. Ignore the presentation, I've literally just slapped that on. A couple of beers on the go. Megs is uh, <laughs> helping us out to some bits as well. Oh, she's got the sauce as well. There we go, I didn't look properly where I couldn't find the sauces. <laughs> But um, yeah, our flight is uh, 10.05 today, um, boarding is 9.15, so we're in here slightly early, so we have about 2 hours and 15 minutes of food and drink, basically. So yeah, see you when we get on. Yo, 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 it's game time, we're on board. I always book the window seats, which is very unfortunate for anyone who sits next to me, <laughs> i.e. Meg. Sorry for the lights are flickering as well, frame rate, GoPro, all that sort of stuff. But um, it's currently saying we've got 7 hours, 57 minutes to our destination. Um, I'm about 5 or 6 beers deep, so that's pretty good. And yeah, I'm not going to vlog too much of the flight, maybe coming down into Chicago side and obviously seeing our boy Max and the journey from there, really. What's your thoughts, Max? I'm really excited. Yeah, we're excited to get on this. But yeah, American Airlines. I literally done this trip a year ago to this week, so it's very, very exciting. See you all when I get to America. Fingers crossed, I'm such a nervous flyer, but I'm chill. Don't worry about it. So we've got about five minutes left to this flight. However, I want to share the skyline with you. Check that out down there. And of course, flying over the Great Lakes, which is just awesome. I'm excited to get down there. Say an extra step. Things on the go. I tell you what, the American Airlines always impresses me more so than British Airways. The way you treat your food is better, seating is better. Boeing 787, I'll be wrong. Awesome. Looks warm up there, is what it does.
So, I'm not saying customs was painful, but an hour and 45 minutes later, we're through. Very warm. <laughs> but uh, yeah, one of the last ones to come through was all literally just came in on the back of another flight. But hey, such is life. It's one of those things. I'm not moaning. I'm hoping Big Yellow is going to be coming through here now with a little bit of luck at some point, hopefully, maybe. I'm doubtful because as you can see, the baggage is, uh, yeah. And also, won't get shouted at for a minute in here either. I know they're a bit uh, strict of rules and stuff. Oh. Who's you saying in there? What's your first thoughts? Oh, <laughs> there we go. She took away inside my boat. It was. Um, wasn't many windows open because it didn't mark people that came through. But it's one of those things. Don't bother me. It's all good. Um, I think I can see a big yellow reflection as well. Because that's always one of the most scariest things for me is the bag not arriving. But yeah, here's big yellow. And Megs is one is right again. So that's the more important thing. So there we go. We're in the car. We've got Max and Sarah in here. I can't Yay! even tell you how excited I am for, am, am for this. I can't even speak. That's how excited I am. But we are currently in Chicago traffic, as you may see. And the excitement is literally just taking over. I think Meg's mind is literally just blown. Yeah. She's just processing everything. Even small things like, like the rear, the train literally goes through the middle of the what's this? Freeway? Highway? Yeah. Freeway? Which is see I'm learning, learning. But yeah. Can't even express to how excited I am, boys. So yeah, just to update on how things are going at the minute. Sorry, I haven't filmed as much of what I wanted to do, but I'll be honest with you, I've been enjoying myself and sometimes it kind of is more important. This, this is my rental and I'm hyped over it. I drove this last year, fell in love with it. It's just cool. Little manual as well. Me and Megs are going to go bombing around in this. It's just some cool stuff. So yeah, we're going to head to the Airbnb now. We did Portillo's, which was awesome. Burger. Phenomenal. So yeah, I'll update you when we're at the Airbnb. So here we go. We've got the truck parked. Look at this. How different is this? Yo, the apartment is incredible. Let me just sell this to you now, right? Living in an apartment for the week. I got Chevy truck keys. This is literally like living in a movie. The old train station, which is incredible. The train does roll through here. Lovely abandoned building as well. I wonder if we can get a bit of Urbex down when we're here. Locomotive right up there, which is awesome. But yeah, the door here, this is where we are. Um, very excited about it. Very, very hyped about it. My boy Max as well, my brother Max, I should say, got me a little goodie here. Look at this. I can't even contain my excitement. We'll do a proper little look through of this sometime. What a gentleman he is. Literally, what a gentleman. Anyway, let's go and have a look at the Airbnb. So, welcome to our home for the next week. I can't even explain to you how much this feels like I'm just living in an American movie, being in an apartment, which is killer. Right down to the Chevy keys on the, on the kitchen counter blowing my mind as i said america for me is life changing every single time so let's check out the bathroom this place has been completely renovated lovely big shower very nice indeed let's just turn this off yeah this apartment has been fully renovated well the whole building has and as you can see to a very high standard i love the dark wood that we have here in america it's got all the appliances so you know you cook stuff here you're a dishwasher literally everything Oh, I love that with the bendy taps. How's that even work? I ain't gonna mess about with it. I don't wanna break it. But uh, we've done a little supply run. And when I mean supply run, <laughs> I literally mean water, bush light. Because I can't tell you how long I've been waiting to have a bush light. But yeah, this place is immaculate. Really, really nice. Just got some snacks over there. Because to be fair, we're gonna be eating out and about most of the time. But massive TV, lovely seat seating area here. See, Taylor, we're on a bit of a mess because we're currently unpacking. Megs is over there still doing that. But uh, yeah, what a great apartment. Air conditioning up there, fan there, big ginger boy there. Um, bed is massive, bed is very comfy too. Uh, what are you saying, Megs, about this place? I think it's a great apartment. I think it's stunning. It really, really is. So, this, well, obviously, we're upstairs as apartment. There's another three or four year. Yeah. Same guy owns them all, they're all on Airbnb. Ah, uh, this is going to be fantastic. Very happy with it. And do you know what? I just got to have a little show you this again. What my, I'm honestly, I'm humbled and blown away by this box. This like, means more to me than, than I can even put into words. So we've got a couple of main lines here. If you're in Hot Wheels or Diecast, you're going to love this. 
nice license plate. I will do a proper video of this, but we've got some American candies in here, which I think I'm very hyped over. But just check out some of the die cast in here from the M2s. Square body is my dream truck to have, and I hope I can make that dream come true at some point. Let's look at some of this stuff, look at this. I can't even explain to you how killer this stuff is. Silverado there, look at that, the Integra. Just such cool things. Honestly, humbled is what I am, and I mean that from the bottom of my heart. What a, an amazing thing to have. Max, you're awesome, bro. Absolutely awesome. But basically, boys and girls, sorry if it's been jumpy from point A to point B. I've currently been at about 24 hours, and this is basically the start of the American series. So stay tuned, content is gonna be dropping throughout the weeks, and yeah, I'm very excited to share it all with you. There's some special stuff coming up on this trip, and I'm gonna be sharing it all year with you. But boys and girls, I shall see you all very, very soon. Oh, sh, Tarano.